Hi everybody, Chris here. We're talking Major League Baseball. Now earlier this year I was here in Dunedin covering the Toronto Blue Jays right here at TD Ballpark Stadium as they got set for the 2020 season. I had a chance to catch up with old friend Caleb Joseph who played for the Bowie Bay Sox and Baltimore Orioles to begin his career. Now the 2020 Major League Baseball season has taken a drastic turn due to the COVID-19 pandemic. I recently caught up with Caleb again as his Toronto Blue Jays were visiting the Baltimore Orioles. Caleb talked about playing in front of no fans, something he did with the Orioles back in 2015 during the Freddie Gray riots, and also talked about what it's like to be on the taxi squad for the Blue Jays. You're basically on the team, but you just don't play in the game. So you do everything normal as if you're on the team, but you don't suit up and you don't play in the games. You try your best to stay ready. It's almost impossible when you're not in there every other day or whatever, but you have to find ways to hit off some velocity machines. You have to find ways to get out there and catch your early batting practice pitchers and catch bullpens and do everything possible to stay ready just in case something happens. And baseball, as we've seen, just look at the uh, injury reports every single night. There's notable names and pieces and pieces of puzzles that are going down. And so you have to be ready. And so that's pretty much the routine for everybody that's on a taxi squad. Uh, fortunately, the Blue Jays are letting me travel around with the club the whole time. That's that's really big, so I feel really a part of the club, and, and I'm really happy here, really excited. Um, I'm kind of in charge of the post-game celebration stuff. It's pretty cool. It's something we uh, have kind of picked up. It's new. Uh, I've pulled some bits and pieces from other teammates and friends that I've had, so that's pretty fun. We uh, Because we're Canadian, we do three stars of the game, right? So it's like hockey, and uh, we do three stars of the game, and so every time we win, we have – me announcing who was the three stars and we stand up and celebrate it. It's even more odd than that one game because there was still, still so much form of normalcy around that game. Uh, the people, the radio, the TV, everything about it was, uh, pretty much the same. There just was no fans and there wasn't these uh, really stringent protocols. Now it is, I mean, as everybody knows, it is so locked down that you, uh, you're sort of hyper aware of everything that's going on. And that sometimes can take over your mindset more importantly than what's going on in the game, if that makes sense. Like, Oh, did I, did I just touch that door handle? Like, and, and you, you know, you start thinking of things like that, sometimes so much more than you would your execution of the game. But it has been really odd. And we, I think everybody league-wise has done a great job. You know, baseball players, we're kind of creatures of habit. And now that that's not our normal and that's not our habit, I'd say the last 10, 15 days have kind of become the new norm. And so you just kind of start moving and living into that type of lifestyle, as I'm sure all of you all have, uh, just with your different changes in life. I mean, look at us, you know, we're – finding ways to do this differently. So it's uh, it's been unique and a challenge, but I'm just glad baseball is being played. I don't know about y'all, but it's sure as fun, even with no fans and with the different quirks. It's still fun being a, a part of baseball games, and I'm, I hope fans are enjoying it just as much as we are.